Uh, it's a symbol of commitment. It's a, uh, the ring symbolizes a, 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 there's no end to the love. It goes all the way, keeps going all the way. And it's a constant reminder that you, of the person you love and the commitment you made to them. Yeah. And uh, as you go through life, people recognize that as a powerful symbol. And they know that there is, number one, there's a happiness behind that ring. And number two, that there's a boundary to let the rest of the world know that, that, that you know, you love somebody the most. Um, and each day, you know, it's a new adventure. I said, I've, I've always talked to people and I tell them, I said, um, it might not always be easy, but it's worth it. And you know that you love somebody when you can't do a thing without them, nothing really matters uh, without them. So you can have all the money, you can have everything that, in the world, but if you have that one person with you to share it with, it, 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 it will matter. You go first. Eating, eating is always good. Um, I like to make most of the meals, and I, but I, I love making dinner for my husband and having him uh, enjoy it, and he'll clean his plate, mm -hmm. uh, and just experiencing life together and new adventures together. Yeah. Everyday life is, is better. I mean, we very rarely get the same day off, so when we do, we kind of plot an adventure for that day. It could be something as little as driving over to the mountains um, and seeing snow. I mean, we don't ever see snow in California. Or we could spend the day going thrift store shopping or um, uh, restaurant hopping is another really fun thing mm -hmm. that I love to do. I said, we'll just go from here to here to here to here. We're both kind of like home nuts. So there's a constant idea of putting the house together and tearing it apart, putting it together and rearranging art and all kinds of stuff. You always want to try and make a, a nice home for your, for your husband oh, yeah. so that when he comes home, it's, it's, a, it's a wonderful place for both of you to share. Sex with a partner is always the best because you can uh, physically just be like, I'm gonna tie your ass up. Mm -hmm. And you know they're not gonna call the police or anything because mm -hmm. you know they're, they're, they're not gonna hurt you. Uh, or you already hurt them. know you're crazy. Of course, right? Yeah. yeah, right? <laughs> and it is one of those things that I, I said, um, uh, I, I think foreplay sometimes when you're married is, Roll over. Yeah. <laughs> or, or, okay. I need. I need some. I, I need some help, honey. I need some help. Exactly. But I love sex so much more with my husband. I know. Yeah. I know. I know. I love it with him. I love it without him. I love watching him do it. You know, that's the kind of funny thing. Is to be like, is that is that the same technique that you use with me? <laughs> but uh, you know, it's, still, it's 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 always the best. Husband with the, sex with husband is always the best. Oh God. Um, uh, At home. <laughs> I mean, that's home is where the heart is. My parent, parent-in-law's bathroom. Oh, well, that's the craziest <laughs> place to buy. No, of course. You know what? It's got to be on the kitchen floor. You start in the bedroom, you end up somehow on the kitchen floor. I just want to make sure the floor is nice and clean and shiny. First. Well, I mean, <laughs> there's that patio out there, but you know the neighbors you know, make that much noise. They're like, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> every single day um, that you go through and of course you say goodbye in the morning but by 10 o'clock something monumental has happened and you have to tell him you have to tell me uh, exactly listen honey I did some laundry even okay. if it's if you see a bunny on the way to work you gotta tell him I and, saw a bunny I and, saw a bunny and that's the, the thing and then you get that excited feeling when you know that it's coming um, when, when it's that time for him to come home and you're like I made it's dinner. about that time, it's about that time, it's about that time, got to go through and call um, and find out where uh, where he is and what kind of thing. Uh, yeah, I, I, and, and God forbid that you have to leave for like a couple of days because you're like, I'll be back in three days. It's just three days, honey, and I'll be right back. Day one, two hours into it, I miss you. I miss you. I can't wait to come home. Um, and then, like, if you're gone for a week, you just assume that, that everything has fallen apart and, and, uh, and, and he's died without you. Um, and you get home and you realize, you know, the only thing he has done is taken his dirty clothes and just kind of piled them in the corner. And that's fine. I can deal with that. Bearfilms.com. Bear yeah. Bear Come films. on, are you kidding? Bearfilms.com. Yeah, that's the only one to do it, you know? It's like you're basically sleeping with your friends all over again. Ha, ha, ha.